today we are going to discuss about the land of snow and ice greenland before start this lesson i have one question are you remember in the previous class uh, we have learned about the heat zones of the earth or climatic zones of the earth are you remember okay uh, related to that uh, heat zones of the earth or climatic zones i have one question already that question say children uh, which climatic zone remains extremely cold throughout the year uh, i will give you one hint that climatic zone lies between arctic circle and north pole in northern hemisphere in southern hemisphere antarctic circle and south pole which is that just remember name the climatic zone that remains extremely cold throughout the year let's discuss characteristics of the polar region my answer is polar region is it in this lesson first we will discuss about characteristics of the polar region locate the greenland vegetation and wild life vegetation and wild life transportation and economic system important cities first we will move characteristics of the polar region in this lesson i will show amazing pictures amazing sceneries and i will explain with amazing picture i will explain very interesting facts let's start we have already studied that areas near poles are in the frigid zone so we know the climate of frigid zone it has extreme cold now greenland is one of the countries which lies in the frigid zone greenland is an island in the north atlantic it is lies in arctic circle around the north pole the areas between the arctic circle and the north pole and between the antarctic circle and the south pole are known as the polar regions the polar region lies in the frigid zone or the tundra region in the northern hemisphere the upper half of alaska northern parts of canada norway sweden northern strip of russia and greenland lie in the region the arctic ocean is located in the northern polar region while the continent of antarctica is located in the southern polar region to understand the life of the people of this region we will study about greenland it lies in the northern polar region nuuk is the capital of greenland earlier it was known as gorthap location greenland is 
located in the northeast of north america greenland is the largest island in the world it became a part of denmark in 1953 it is ruled by the government of denmark it was formed in the year 1981 its capital is nuuk earlier it was known as gothab it is also the largest island in the world it was discovered by eric the red greenland lies between the north pole and the arctic circle to the northeast of canada it is separated from the northern islands of canada by the baffin bay and the davis strait neighbors it shares its border with the atlantic ocean in the southeast children have you observed the picture greenland sea in the east the arctic ocean in the north and the baffin bay in the west iceland and canada are the neighboring countries of greenland climate greenland experiences extremely cold greenland experiences extremely cold climate throughout the year it experiences more than 80% of the island is covered with the thick ice the average temperature in greenland ranges between minus 23 degree celsius in winter to 5 degree celsius in summer greenland has a polar climate it is very cold throughout the year the lowest temperature recorded is minus 66 degree celsius in 1954 in summer the sun shines brightly all the 24 hours in most parts of the island the sun shines even in midnight also therefore greenland is also called as the land of the midnight sun and one more interesting point this region receives a maximum yearly rainfall 25 cm during summer in winter lasts for 9 to 10 months and during the winters the sun does not rise above the horizon or horizon in summers there is continuous daylight it is bright and sunny the sun can be seen even at midnight it is called the land of the midnight sun very interesting is it children the picture is also very amazing and beautiful i like this picture in winter there is no sunlight because the sun does not rise above the horizon these are months of darkness very interesting picture is it children surface here mountains are covered with thick snow have you observed the picture this snow cover is called 
ice cap and sometimes these ice cap break off slide down and fall into the sea these floating ice blocks are called icebergs or sometimes huge pieces of ice break off and drift into the sea these are called ice icebergs see here see children just uh, observe the picture just i told you what did i tell you sometimes these ice cap break off slide down and fall into the sea these floating ice blocks are called icebergs is it see these type of icebergs they are very dangerous for the ships why why because the major part of an iceberg is below the sea water because of this reason these icebergs are very dangerous see here i want to share uh, one important incident uh, have you seen the titanic picture these icebergs are very dangerous for ships passing through his regions in 1912 what happened a huge ship called titanic sank into sea after hitting iceberg very interesting see children just uh, observe the picture just i told you the major part of an uh, iceberg is below the sea water can you see the picture 90% of the ice is below the sea water is it only 10% iceberg is uh, we can see only 10% of iceberg but remaining 90% of iceberg is below the sea water huge sometimes huge piece of ice break off and slide down into the sea they are called icebergs now vegetation as greenland experience severe winters very few plants and trees grow here due to extreme cold plants cannot grow here during summers mosses lichens grasses and yellow trees grow here they are very short trees the only natural forest in greenland is found in the kingua valley the forest consists birch and gray leaf willow lichens and mosses grow on the rocks and provide fodder for animals animal life in greenland it has surprisingly rich wildlife which have uh, thick coat or uh, skin survive here polar bears muskox lemming arctic fox reindeer seal and husky are found here one more interesting fact about uh, uh, that uh, arctic tern arctic tern it is a small sea bird it fly uh, it flies to greenland in summer and uh, migrates to the south pole in winter see here huskies are wolf like dogs and these are important domestic animals in greenland they are used for hunting animals and pulling sledges the sea around greenland is home to many species of fish such as trout salmon and cod animals which have 
thick coat or skin survive in greenland polar bears muskox lemming arctic fox reindeer arctic tern seal and husky are found here huskies are wolf like dogs and these are important domestic animals in greenland they are used for hunting animals and pulling sledges the lifestyle of the people economic activities agriculture and industry the economy of greenland is mainly dependent on fishing have you observed the picture and fish exports here most of the country's income comes from the fishing industry agriculture is practiced on a smaller scale in the southern part of the country the people of southern greenland also practice sheep farming fish processing is the major industry or uh, major occupation here sheep are uh, raised in a small numbers in the southwestern coast a very small part of land in the southwest is uh, suitable for agriculture and some vegetables such as potatoes are grown here natural resources and economic activities first we will discuss natural resources greenland is rich in natural resources lead and zinc are found in abundance like uranium copper and gold are also found here transportation roadways in greenland is limited to certain parts of the country popular means of transportation are dog sledges and snowmobiles the eskimos are excellent hunters they hunt seals whales and polar bear in the past they use blows and harpoons to hunt animals another widely used means of transport are ships kayaks aircraft and helicopters etc modern lifestyle of greenland the native people of greenland are called eskimos but most of them have now mixed with other europeans here people speak language called greenlandic they are now greenlanders or inuits eskimos are short and stout they have a yellowish skin high cheek bones and narrow eyes they lead a very hard life during winter the eskimos live in igloos igloos means igloos it is uh, made up of ice blocks modern igloos can be made of wood stone and skin during summer they live in skin tent called tube pigs and uh, in greenland populous towns such as nuuk sismut and the weak hooded jackets called parks made of skin of seal and reindeer 
food items made from fish are popularly eaten in the country here sports such as football skiing and badminton are popular among people here there are many museums such as the greenland national museum and the archives in nuuk nuuk is the capital of greenland which display folk art pieces and other items of cultural significant let's have a quick recap of greenland lesson greenland is the largest island in the world its capital is new it lies between the north pole and the arctic circle to the northeast of canada greenland lies in the northern hemisphere between the arctic circle and the north pole greenland experiences extremely cold climate throughout the year grass shrubs and wild plants grow in greenland the animals found in greenland have thick coats of fur thank you